So for Copenhagen side bridges, there's going to be a uh, regressed uh, version of them, which is going to have the knee bent. Okay, so what we want to have is a 90 degree bend uh, of the thigh and calf of the front uh, leg or the top leg, sorry. And then the bottom leg is also going to be bent to a 90 degree angle. What we want to see here is the arm that's pressed into the ground. You're constantly pressing your shoulder blade through the ground. Go ahead and lift up. So there's going to be two different ways that we program these. One is going to be for held uh, time. So go ahead and hold. So we're just going to have you keep your whole uh, calf pressed through the bench. Okay. Other leg at 90 degrees. Rib cage stays in. Opposite arm stays pressed out. And we're just going to have you hold for whatever time is prescribed in your program specifically. We can also have you do it for repetition. So go ahead and go down and then up. So slowly lower with control and up. Make sure that we keep a stack position or a straight line from our shoulder down to our knee, okay? The progression of this is gonna be to uh, increase the lever arm or do this with a straight leg, okay? So straight uh, top leg is gonna be completely locked out. Uh, the more difficult is it's gonna be the less of your uh, shin or calf is on the bench. So if just your foot's on, it's gonna be harder. If you slide this way, it's gonna be a little bit easier, okay? Uh, and what we wanna do, same thing as before, like we said, so come on up. We're in a straight line from our shoulder right down into this heel, okay? We can do it for held time here, which is gonna be programmed, or it might be programmed for reps. So for reps, we're slowly lowering, constantly keeping our pressed arm, shoulder blade, pressed through the ground. Beautiful.